We've got a quick question for you about these two squares. True or false, this top one here is a darker gray than the bottom one. Pretty obvious, right? Well, maybe not, because the answer is actually false. Believe it or not, they are exactly the same color. OK, come on over. We're going to do a test. Bo is going to prove to you and a group of volunteers that the two squares are the same color gray. When you open your eyes, right, first time in the morning, say, do you think you see the world as it really is? I say yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. You're seeing it. Oh, you're, you're seeing definitely. And believing. That depends if I'm wearing my glasses or not. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yes? I yeah. think so. I mean, why not? <laughs> All right, well, look at this cube here. What if I told you that those two surfaces are exactly the same? Would you believe me? Yes. I wouldn't. OK, come on up. OK? Bo has attached a gray swatch to one of the surfaces to allow you and the volunteers to test this one out for yourselves. Take that dot and move that nice up here, right there. Oh, my <laughs> god. <laughs> No way! <laughs> I want to look again. Not... <gasps> what the? <laughs> this is crazy. Mind blown. <laughs> Your mind's been blown. Just... Are you also having trouble believing this one? As we discussed in our other video about perception, we define perception as our interpretation of reality. So let's understand what is happening in this video with regards to the stages of perception exposure, attention, and comprehension that we discussed. Now we are exposed to the two squares and are paying attention to it, of course. Our brain is trying to figure out, aka comprehend what it is seeing. And to comprehend what it is seeing, our brain relies on existing mental models that are already present in our brain, based upon our past experience and our knowledge that we have gained throughout our life. And one very strong mental model that is present in our brain is with regards to how shadows work. So our mental models are so strong that it might distort the information in front of our eyes to match the mental model. As we see explained in the model about how shadows work is so strong that it distorts the information that we are getting through our eyes. So the interpretation of reality is very, very different than reality itself. This is something called selective perception because whatever we perceive is based upon our existing mental model and may not reflect the reality. Your brain's using its past experience to generate its perceptions of the world. And so the brain looks at this image and it says, ah, oh, this surface is in shadow. Okay? If this surface were actually in shadow and returning the same amount of light to your eye as this surface, which seems to be in light, this would actually have to be more reflective. There's less light hitting it, but the same amount is hitting your eye as this one, right? And so that's why you see it as lighter. Was that confusing? Let's simplify this. Bo is saying the gradients and shadows he's painted here give your brain clues that the top is a well-lit gray surface and the bottom is a poorly lit white surface clues your brain trusts because of your past experience with shadows. Now let's see how our brain interprets or comprehends information when the two sensory inputs are giving us conflicting information. Ba, ba, what ba, sound is she making? Ba, 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 is she saying the word ba, ba, ba fa, ba, or ba, ga? Ba, ba, ba. Why is it so hard to tell what the answer is? Working soft sticks. Have you decided what word our actress is saying? Ga, fa, or ba? Close your eyes for a moment and just listen. Keep them closed. Ba, 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 Clearer now? Ba, 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 the word is ba, ba right? Ba, ba, Why was it easier with your eyes closed? Ba, 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 this test ba, illustrates what is called the McGurk ba, effect. Ba, ba, We've placed ba, video footage of our actress saying the word ga 
over the sound of her saying ba. Ba, 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 ba. Just ba, like in the rubber hand ba, trick, your ba, brain trusts ba, what your eyes are telling it implicitly and alters your other senses to accommodate. Your brain literally changes what you're hearing to hear a phantom word other than ba. It turns out your ears, like your eyes, are not always to be trusted.